Hello everyone and welcome to World of Warships and I present to you the Arkansas Beta. The ship you got for participating in 50 battles in the closed beta test of World of Warships. Now, this is the USS Arkansas. And she does pack 12 12 inch guns. Dreadnought style of ship. Now she does have one very big problem that you will probably be noticing. And that is no AA guns. That's right. You have zero anti air. You have a lot of secondary batteries, but nothing that can actually shoot above you. At tier four as a battleship, this could be a severe problem. It really could actually be a problem, but we're going to make it work. So in the current build, high explosive is probably your best bet because of all the secondary issues it causes. You know, knocked out gun batteries, broken steering, um, setting them on fire, because I just want to watch the world burn. Anyway, so I am sailing through here on New Dawn and looking for targets and being trolled you know if you guys want to troll me you go right ahead I'm not I'm gonna comment back but it's not really affecting me it's not gonna discourage me it's not gonna it's not gonna really you know hurt me that much in the meantime let's focus on what's going on here so I'm sailing towards our own base point. And I'm looking out over the side of my ship to see if that destroyer way out there at the maximum end of my range spots anything. Doesn't seem to have spotted anything right now. <laughs> he tried to be better than Fag and Lame. <sighs> Oh yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the Alien Isolation so far. I'm jumping out of my skin, and apparently um, I haven't even found anything threatening yet. <sighs> but we're going to take aim here. And we're looking to see if that destroyer is coming out, and then look what's going on around me. Somebody's carrier brought an air superiority package, and it's just laying out the pain. Now the problem with the Arkansas Beta's guns... As you see, none of them go where they're pointed. Oh yeah, kind of like Markiplier plays SCP, American Jesus. That's kind of, you know, the point here. Oh, what's this? What's this? A, a Japanese cruiser? Hey, it's the actual guy who's making fun of me. And all of that is fighters overhead having it out. Of course, I am detected, which is a problem. But then I go, huh. That cruiser should be coming out right about there. With all my house of pain. One shell. One shell out of all 12 of my guns. All the... That air superiority package from that carrier is just having fun. All right, reload the guns. Let's let's let America Jesus really have it. And I'm trying to stay at long range, but he's not giving me much of a choice. Oh, there's a good slap. Two shells. <laughs> Get used to this, by the way, if you're if you're gonna drive this thing or if you see this thing. It ain't hitting the broadside of a barn with many shells, but it will hit them eventually. One of my volleys will do. One of my shells from my volley will do something. I hope. We are loaded for bear. 
Now, if the bear would be so kind as to run up and put its chest right up against the muzzle of the gun, that would be nice. I keep zooming out, and I keep trying to aim my AA guns, and then realizing, oh yeah, I don't have any AA guns. Oh yeah, I don't have any AA guns. Why don't I have AA guns? I don't even have a scout plane. You definitely have to rely on your allies for AA protection and for scouting. That's why I'm sailing in the middle of three cruisers. See if I can arc the shells over the island, and the answer is, well, one of the four I flung went over. So probably not. However, oh, what's this? You've run aground, American Jesus? I'm sorry. Not really. Set you on fire. Two of your main batteries are destroyed. And now he's burning. Oh, he's sunk. He sunk. American Jesus, thanks for the trolling attempt. You, sir, have been a, a very fun character, but you're down with the fishes now. And that is a Wyoming class. The same class ship I am, but because he's upgraded, he actually can outrange me. I'm anticipating a cruiser's gonna come out there. Shells bouncing off my armor. I'm turning around. I'm not not sailing into the teeth of their fleet. It's not going to happen. I simply refuse. Somebody took out a carrier. Nice job. Oh, that destroyer's back there harassing their carriers. Ow. Well, my self-heal that I used, because I thought I was safe for a bit, isn't quite going to heal me as much as I thought it would. Oh crap. I'm at full rudder right. I'm full rudder starboard. That's a torp. I don't I don't think I can do anything about this. Torpedo. Oh uh, I might pass it and swing. Come on, swing, swing, swing. I'm not gonna make it! No! Did that torpedo just go dead? Like right there? Thank you! That could have really hurt! And instead it went dead at like the worst possible location. I just don't know what to say about that one. Totally went dead. They closed the window because I'm a little loud. Uh, where's the cruiser? Where is he? Oh, that one went down. This cruiser's got to be coming up here. Is he run aground? Did this cruiser run aground? Where's he at? I'm detected. I'm a battleship. Of course I'm detected. Where'd that cruiser go? I want to put... Now, you guys can see, I've turned around to get away from the teeth of their fleet, and now we have a cruiser that's potentially isolated up here. And I'm really looking for him. Like, I'm, there he is. There he is. There's my target. Turn my guns. Yep, he ran aground. Let him have everything we ha can. All my rage, all my fury, and all my pain. And he does take a significant amount of damage. And the torpedo comes in and falls short. And, oof, just wailing on him. And I'm bringing the last gun battery around. And I let him have it. And I don't know why my number four battery can't shoot at him right now. But my number four battery is registering is unable to fire. He then turns into me, a battleship. One hit, blows his rudder. He's now stuck going that direction. And he's on, he's burning from stem to stern. That's just mean. I have incoming rounds and they bounce off. Hello, the Arkansas actually has armor. A lot of it. The armor-piercing rounds are quite ineffective against its hull. 2,000 damage. I can take that. I'm going to finish off this cruiser with everything I have. Ooh. Blow him right out of the water. I'm taking some fire from some cruisers now. I activate my self-repair ability. Ooh, God, I walked into a world of pain here. Uh, I'm outraged by that Wyoming. That's the maximum end of my gun range. I... 
don't know if those shells are even gonna... Oh, nope, we set them on fire. Which, did he put that out already? I'm now taking a beating. I've lost a quarter of my health very quickly, and I'm trying to hit this Wyoming, who I set back on fire. Burn. And number four battery finally gets on, I let it go. And number two and number one, and I'm just, we're having a gunnery duel. A good old fashioned battleship slugfest. Ugh. That hurt. Which he is technically winning. He did put out the fires, but now he's got a full three batteries at him. Nothing hit. And that's the problem with the Arkansas data. A lot of your shots, I mean, there's no consistent gun accuracy. Look at where the, the shells are just landing everywhere. I set him back on fire. Somebody else set him on fire. They probably blew his rudder, which is why he's run aground now. And he's just continuing to fire at me, but I'll shoot back. Uh, and this little... This little Murmansk next to me is also putting out rounds. I fire where he has to move. He has to back up in order to get out of his run around. Knock out a secondary battery. He is on fire from stem to stern. He's just bleeding hit points right now. This poor Wyoming. Just getting shelled by multiple ships. Ow. Light you back on fire, bud. You're going to burn. There's nothing you can do about it. That's why I like the AG shells. I mean, they might not do the most damage, but they are pretty consistent about the amount of damage they do. And the fires. Uh, and while his secondary batteries doesn't affect him, particularly at this range, and there's my last repair. If they're going to sink me, they're going to sink me. I'm trying to arc the shells over this island. It just doesn't happen. However, I only fired half my batteries, so I, the other half is coming up, but it won't come up in time. He's going to go down. Ugh, a waste of a volley. I should have held the shot. I should have held the shot so much. There is my last repair. I've probably repaired myself for as many hit points as I have. Fire off half my shots. See if any of them land. Oh, oh, oh. We did get some hits. We blew his rudder. Fire off the other half. I put too much lead into it and he turned. Disappointingly, he has turned. I've got seven seconds until I can rip into this Omaha. Who's a higher tier than me, by the way? But this is a battleship. Higher tier does not guarantee that you can take it on, even at half my health. Half the volley hits, destroys a fifth of his hit points. I'm on fire. I let it burn for a second, just to make sure I'm not going to set back on fire. And then I put it out. And he turns, but takes a hit. I'm going to run aground. I'm going to run aground intentionally. I'm going to use it for cover. Uh, so half my shells hit the terrain. Only one shell hits him, but it does light him. Problem solved, sir. I'm, I know I'm running aground. I don't care. I'm doing it intentionally. I'm using this island for cover so I can arc shells over. But then I realized that that's not going to work out for me. So I start to turn and cruise around the edge of this island. So far, 37 hits, 6 fires, I sank one ship. I have taken a lot of abuse. Were you shooting at me or the enemy? I have taken a full-on beating. And again, trying to arc shells over that island. Not quite working for me, but we're going to cap out before... Um, I can get another volley off, so I had to take the risk. And that's the end of this one. So, 
we're going to move on, take a look at the stats, and then that's going to be it for World of Warships. Hope you guys have enjoyed the Arkansas beta. So, here we go. 124,979 credits, 2200 experience points, plus the 111 free XP. Not a bad day. Also, got the heavy damage complete. That's what I'm talking about. Did some, wow, 41,000 to 60,000 effects of shooting. I'll take it. Overall team status, I came in 4th place on the team amongst a tier 5 team. Not bad. I sank a ship. Not bad. And I did a total of 40, of just over 41,000 damage. Just over my total hit points and damage is my total damage output. Again, not a bad match in the Arkansas. I've actually, I actually like this ship. It's kind of like, um, the, uh, the War Spite. I like the War Spite. It's just kind of difficult to use with the short range. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this replay. I hope it shows you how to use this ship and how to counter it. Remember, it has no anti-aircraft. Stay near your cruisers. They're your best friends. In the meantime, this is Fiora, officially signing out for right now, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and if you did, why not click the like button? It would really help the channel and let me know that you're enjoying my content. Want to see more content? There's a subscribe icon right there so you know when I put up videos I would appreciate it also if you help grow this channel's community. So share this with your friends or just put it up on Facebook. Want to help Fiora out directly? There are three ways you can do this. One is the patronage page which all the investment towards I put right back into the channel through contests and paying for things like video editing software. Then there are two ways to support the channel directly. One is click the ads that YouTube shows you. This is how YouTube pays its content creators, by your clicks on those advertisements. The other and last way to support the channel is through fan funding that is now available through Fiora's channel page. If you happen to have an extra dollar or two, it would really let Fiora know that her videos mean something to you. Anyway, please check out these other videos here on the end page collage. And as always, I will see you on the battlefield or in the next video. Till then, this is Fiora signing out.